Why is he trash? God damn it, Jinko. <laughs> Sorry, gosh darn it. Nice instant pin. Oh, missed the uh, B reverse on the DFS. I don't know how Corrin does in this matchup. I'm not sure either. <laughs> I feel like it's one of the more even ones. It certainly helps that Corrin gets a bit more range than a lot of other um, melee grounded characters like between the side B and such a rangy forward smash. Ooh, the patience coming out from both players. Nice spot dodge. Nice. Oh, he charged the... Yep. He charged the DFS too long. Ooh. Ooh, see, on the shorter characters, if you pin them at the right spot, the kick won't connect if you do the forward one. <laughs> it would have if he would have done Dumb. the backwards one. It's weird. It's like finicky, too. Oh. All right. Yeah, they're just kind of putting up a wall, trying to make it hard for Jibka to land at the moment. Ooh. Questionable counter. Yeah. But I see what he was going for. He was trying to react to the bomb coming out. Yeah, I could but see he, that. But he gassed instead of reacting. At that range, I don't think he could have reacted. I think it was justifiable. That's a dead tune link. Mm. Oh wow! He didn't die. Di di. <laughs> he didn't die though. Gosh, nope. most characters die. Went straight for that corner. The backwards Ooh. bite box. It's very uh. Can I have a? Uh... Yeah, Jim needs to secure this kill, yet he's starting to get he killed need, he, just needs a, now. he just needs a grab. Yeah, grab is an up throw that kills. Yeah, mm. oh, down throw I'll kill now, too. Oh, okay. yeah. He got it. Yeah. I would have jabbed or uh, fumbled to make sure, but at around 145 is when it starts killing yeah. a lot of characters. He does have a bit of rage now, too. I think he was confident in it. All right. More pin play. It uh makes neutral kind of a frustrating experience for the other player. Yeah. Instant pin is uh, a lot of mobility, as well as an attack. I think he should be pinning more. I think if um if he loses this, I could see him picking a platform stage and doing some more pin work. He was doing that a bit in friendlies. It uh. Yeah, the platforms give um core and a lot of uh, movement options, a lot of mobility. Just yeah. that was really, really good. Oh, ooh, bomb fair. Not quite gonna seal it, but the next one will oh. probably do it. Yeah, I was gonna say it looks like up an up smash. smash to me. Now is he in a counter pick stage or character? I could see him switching to cloud, just cause. Wait, is this? Oh, this is winter still. Okay. Yep. I don't know. I, I think. Oh, yep. There he goes. Yep. That's yeah. That's the big question. Switch to the main or switch? Okay. And he still went to Battlefield. I saw Battlefield coming out if he picked if he stayed Corrin. So. Getting those micro charges in. Yeah, and that's you know part of what makes Cloud such a disgusting character is like sitting and charging, forcing your opponent to make a decision quickly. He gets so much from just standing still. Yeah. Well, he's using a move, but it, you can do anything you want out of it. And not only does it give him new cool special moves, it makes him faster, and he's got different gravity. Yeah, it, it's just ridiculous. I think he gets heavier. Yeah, I, I think uh, yeah, I think gravity is the way they described it. Heavier gravity is so that it doesn't change certain aspects, but I, I'm not too... That's where I get a little wishy-washy with where gravity or weight nice. affects things more. You take the stock nice and uh, cleanly. 
And then offstage side B. That move is a very solid move for offstage punishes, onstage punishes. That was very smart. Yeah. He used the... Uh, what is it? Is that Clem Hazard? Yep. Yeah. Clem Hazard. Using Clem Hazard <laughs> to uh, get to the ledge really quickly so he wasn't too far in the air for a long time. Cloud Snare being one of the, the like one of the better moves in the, in the game overall. Yeah. Covering a wide range, and it's fast with a uh, little to no end leg. And it can, yeah, it can auto cancel, and it also, nice. yeah, that range is gross. It hits almost completely around him. Makes it a nice follow up, especially like if you whiff an up air, you usually you catch them with an air if they're not reacting. See, yep. Game's almost tied up. Yeti looking to tag on some percentage. Jupia again forcing Yeti up on the platform so that he could kind of sit under him with those fast up airs. Nice jab too into roll away. Yeah, neither player over committing right now. Again, with jab two and a roll away, super strong. Cloud has really good frame data on his jab. I don't know it off the top of my head. I don't either. I want to say it's got to be a three or four for the first jab. Jipka effectively, nice. Jipka effectively good. using his Foxtrot to his advantage in this matchup. Almost looking and like when melee. When the trade with side B there. Um, Side B wins out just about every shade I could think of with Cloud when it's limit, right? Yeah. It does a million damage, too. Battlefield? Do we see the next character counter pick? Probably not. I could see him sticking to him, Link, but. Going <laughs> well, to Falcon, he's like, I'm going to match the speed. Go against my own words. Yeah. Oh, Smashville. All right. I respect both the choices. Let's see that nice random Captain Falcon play that Yeti likes to do. He just does a bunch of random good stuff. But yeah. It's not like I think it helps he can play a faster, more rushdown oriented oh. character. Ooh, that's with pressure stock. on limit. Taking a stock super early at like 60 percentage. Yeah. Get well, a nice clean. That's you know you lose your jump, it gives you a lot of trouble. Especially on Cloud without limit. This looks like it's going to be a really uh, fast game three because Yeti yeah. is out to take Jibka's life in, yeah. the in the game. Yeti with a lot of pressure, and it's making Jibka impatient too, I think. Uh, his, his charges are coming. Nice, Ooh. that's the game. Yeti with the clean two stock at 62%, wow. coming out, being doing the stuff that Yeti likes to do. That knee looked like it was a true combo too. Yeah, it looked like up air to knee. Rising up air to knee. I see Jibka. Oh, and we're in best of five? Yep, because it's winter studies. All right. I want to see Jibka make an adaption, adaptation, adaptability. Okay. Pokemon? Okay, an adaption uh. <laughs> to this Falcon, taking him to Lilat. Just putting on pressure with these. Jab threes. Nice. Game's even up. Jibka almost at limit. When you're playing Cloud, you don't want to fully charge your limit. I mean, he did there, but usually you want to turn it up just really close. So if you get hit, you get it, but you want to have yeah. access to your specials in neutral. But he's looking for a kill now, now that he has limit up. Or he's just going to hold on to it for the fear factor. Trying to hit the two, the two frame ledge snap with the down tilt. Text the down air there. That's Ooh. a kill. No, it's not going to kill. Not going to kill, but Super Red close. Yeti's side B and... That's going to kill. That was optimal DI too. I believe so, at least. Nah. Alright. That down smash, though. He's going to get another limit charged in the meantime. Nice. 
charge, yep. Full of it. You know, there's that, that pressure Cloud adds. It, you, even when you're recovering, it makes you decide, do I need to quickly attack him or what's your getup going to be? You can't wait. He gets too much pressure from one ability. <laughs> yeah, from not doing anything other than charging. He just stands there. It's a free mind game. And the bonus stats it gives him, too, is just kind of... We're seeing... Might have to use his limit here, yep. yep. Not risking it. Yeah, felt, felt the offstage game nice. coming. Oh, not risking it for the chocolate biscuit. Ooh. Ooh. I understand the fear, Edge but guard. after... Oh, Ooh. that... What is that? Oh! Ooh, lie lie -lied. Lied. A dirty Lilat stage action. Game four, going Fiddy. Closing out the set. All right. And we're going to get up for you now. We have... Right. Uh, we got Dionysus and Carbuncle.